Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today uh, I've got a little mini kind of haul for you guys of some things that I picked up in the last couple of days and then we are going to do a closet clear out. So I've been wanting to clean out my closet and get rid of a few things for a while now. I just haven't quite gotten around to it and I thought now that I went out and got some new stuff, I really should clean out what I've got and what I don't wear. So I thought first I would just go through the new things that I got, show them to you guys, try them on for you, and then we will go and we will get started on cleaning out my closet. And I'm going to try to be brutal. I've stood there and like looked at stuff and thought about getting rid of stuff and then thought of a reason why I should keep it, but I don't wear it so then I really shouldn't be keeping it. Anyway. We're gonna go ahead and get started. So the first place I went was H&M and I got a few things, they're all tops. The first things are two, um, I guess bralettes you could call them because they're not like really necessarily bra style, but they're these. I picked up two of these. I already have one of these in white and I grabbed one because I needed it to wear with an outfit and I didn't have anything white, so I just grabbed it. And it's become like one of my favorite ones to wear. It's got this like really stretchy band at the bottom and so there's no wires in it so so comfortable so I went back and I grabbed this peachy colored one and then I also grabbed this black one which it's not exactly the same but it's close enough that I'm sure it'll be really comfy and fit very very similar so I got both of those okay then the next thing I got is this gray kind of cardigan styled um, top that just buttons up in the front and it's a really thin kind of um, material but I did wear it the other night and it's really really cute and you could wear it with something under it but I just wore it with that pink bralette and it looked really really cute so you can just wear this as like a normal top and then the next stuff is actually the same top in three different colors I will try all of them on for you but it, it's just this strappy tank top cropped tank top but yes it's got this cute v-neck and it sits really nicely. I tried it on with high-waisted jeans and like mid-waist jeans and it sat like comfortably and nicely on both of them. And then I thought it was so cute and such like a staple piece that I did grab the black one and the gray one. I just thought it'd be so easy to wear under stuff or as a, a top on its own. Like just really simple basic kind of piece to have. So that's everything that I grabbed from H&M. The next two things are two pairs of jeans. They're both from River Island and I was specifically looking for jeans because I had a pair that were from ASOS and the back pocket of it started to like split. So there was basically a hole in the back pocket and then one day I went and I pulled them up and the belt loop popped off. So I stopped wearing those and I've been looking for some new jeans to kind of fill that space I guess in my wardrobe. Um, so I picked up two because honestly I couldn't decide between them. They're, they look almost exactly the same except one is more ripped. So the first pair I'm actually wearing right now and I've been wearing for a couple days and they are super comfy, super flattering. Um, they really like fit nicely. They're the River Island Haley jeans I think. These are the Haley ones. Um, and yeah, they're just this light washed color. They've got slight rips on, you know, the sides. Not even rips. It's just kind of, you know, fraying. I guess these are the high-waisted ones. And they fit really nice at the waist. They're comfy. They're nice, actually, like, thick, real jean material, which I do like. I haven't had anything like that in a while. Okay, so then the second pair of jeans and the last thing that I got are these jeans. As you can see, they're really, really similar to the previous jeans I had on. These are also River Island, but these are the Molly jeans, and they are mid-rise jeggings is what it says. But they're a really nice, thick jean material, light wash. Again, they've got the rips at the knees and then also at the ankle. Um, so yeah, I just think these really flattering as well. Honestly, couldn't decide between the two, and they actually have... Real? Oh, this one I have real pockets. Oh, I thought this one had real pockets. The one, the other ones have real pockets. This one don't. Oh, I thought they had real pockets in the front. Oh, okay. Darn, I thought they had real pockets. But I'm still gonna keep them. It's not like a deal breaker or anything. But it's it's just so exciting when you find like women's jeans with real pockets. It's like amazing. So yeah, these are the mid-rise ones, 
And yeah, I'm super, super happy with these. I've been wanting jeans like this and the previous pair for a while now. Okay guys, so that's gonna be it for the clothing haul part of this. We are gonna go ahead and go to my closet now and start getting rid of things. Okay, so we've moved over now to where my closet is. This is my side of the closet. So we're gonna go through all of this and then I've got a couple of drawers in the dresser over here that are mine that I'm gonna go through also. So the way I've got it organized is just kind of like tank tops are here and then into like t-shirt kind of thing and then into long sleeves and there's dresses and then long sleeve shirts and sweaters and kind of that's sort of how it goes. So I think what I'm gonna do is just kind of like go through stuff and pull out the things that I really don't wear anymore. This little white top, I definitely wear that a lot. This I wear. This is one of my like nicer tank top. It's kind of crisscross in the back. I've had it for a while. I don't wear it that often, but I'm not ready to get rid of it yet. This one I'm not too sure about. It's um, an American Eagle tank top that I did get a while ago, probably like four or five years ago, I want to say. And it's really cute. I'm just not sure if I want this anymore. I'm gonna like leave that as a maybe because I don't know. This top, I do wear this one a lot. This one, I like this. I don't wear it very often because it's more of like a, a dressy kind of like businessy style but I have worn this before and I do like it so I'm gonna hold on to this. This shirt, it's American Eagle like off the shoulder. I used to like it but I never reach for this anymore so that one's gonna go. I did it. I got rid of one thing so far. Let's try and make that number a little bit higher here. This top I wear quite a bit. Same as the striped one. This I do like. This orange top a lot. This one I have had for a while and I just don't think it's really my style anymore. I don't ever reach for it so that one's gonna go. These are the same top in two different colors and I do wear these when it's cooler out. So I am gonna hold on to these. This blue top I picked up in a uh, like vintage store and I do really like this. So that one's gonna be kept. It's just like, you know, not the season for it. So this red top is really, really cute. The lighting's not great in here. So it's kind of looking like a little bit orangey, but it is a bright red um, color. It's really cute, but is too small for me now and I don't wear it. So that one is going. This one, I've had this, I feel like forever, but I still wear it. And it's just kind of like a staple piece that I just like to hold on to. Definitely keeping my USA sweater. Okay. So I'm moving more into the dresses now and I like dresses. I just don't wear them a ton. So I'm going to try and be brutal through here. This little pink dress, really cute. And I do wear this, but I don't really like love the pattern or the color so much of it, but I really like the style of this dress. So I wanna find more dresses in this style, but in different colors and prints. But <sighs> I'm gonna part with this. It needs to go. This is a newer dress that I haven't had a chance to wear. This new look dress I've had for ages and it's really cute. I just don't know where to wear it. So pretty much to hold on to it because I do feel like I will wear this somewhere. This one, similar to some other, uh, some other stuff, is I haven't really had a chance to wear it, but I think it's really cute and I like wish I would wear it. So I'm gonna put that in the I'm not sure pile. This dress, love this one, so definitely keeping. Definitely keeping this white one as well. I haven't worn it much, but I really, really think it's cute. So I'm gonna keep that one. I wear the striped dress a ton. This dress, I don't wear it very, like hardly at all, but it does have some sentimental values to me. So I am gonna keep this one. Definitely keeping this dress. I love this one. It's really great for, you know, like Christmas time, New Year's. This dress, I don't think I've ever worn it. And honestly, I don't think I really will. So that one's gonna go. This dress I wear, this dress, I love this one. I wore it um, when we were in the US, not the last time, but the time before that. And it was really comfy. This is a really long, like maxi dress kind of thing. And I've never worn this either. And I never really reach for it, so. That's gonna go too. This is my black jumpsuit. I'm gonna keep that. This dress, I don't wear it, so it's going. I do wear this one. I do wear this one. Okay, so that's all of the dresses. The next bit is like long sleeves and sweater kind of stuff, but I feel like that's gonna be tricky to decide on because it's, you know, we're in summer now, so it's not really like the season for it, but I will try and base it off of what I did wear last year. I guess. So after taking a quick glance at like these long sleeve stuff, pretty much everything I did wear during the winter, the only thing that I see myself wanting to get rid of is this H&M sweater. It's really, really cute and I like the style of it, but 
it's one of those ones you have to like shave and it, they get really flaky and it's not the softest so you have to wear something underneath it so i just think i'm gonna part with this one and that's fine with me and then all the way in the back here i've got this tan jacket which i've worn a handful of times and um i don't know i just don't think it's the most flattering fit on me so i never reach for it anymore so there's no point in keeping it and after thinking about it i'm going to hold on to both of these things because i could see myself wearing them at some point but if i don't wear them in between now and like the next time i clear out my closet then they're gonna go okay so i've moved over to my first drawer now and this is like my jeans and bottoms and all sorts of stuff like that in here i'm just going to go through this really quickly because i already have an idea of the things that i don't want to keep first thing is this pair of jean shorts i am going to hold on to these just because I don't have any other jean shorts at the minute. And I, want, I want new ones. Like I don't particularly like these anymore. But I'm going to hold on to these just so I have some. These two skirts, definitely keeping. These green shorts, I love these. I'm holding on to those. This blue skirt is really cute. I just haven't had the chance to wear it yet. So I'm going to hold on to that because I do plan on wearing this at some point. This skirt I haven't worn in forever. So that's going to go. I never wear this skirt either. This one I do like, so I am going to hold on to this for a little while because I do wear this occasionally. These striped pants I am going to hold on to just because I haven't had anywhere to wear them yet. These I have never worn, so they're definitely going. These jeans I am going to keep because they're just nice, like a relaxed fit, kind of looser jean. And they're just nice for kind of like around the house when you want to be dressed but still be comfy and casual. These red pants I love, but the last time I tried them on they did not fit me nicely. So I have to try them on again and see if they do fit me. And if not, then I will get rid of them. Never wear these anymore. So the only things left in there are just a couple pairs of leggings that I do wear. So I'm not even going to bother pulling those out because I know I'm keeping them. So I've got two more drawers that I need to go through. I'm probably not going to film that or show you because it's not very exciting stuff. It's just little things that I need to go through. Uh, but I will show you the pile when I'm all finished. Okay guys, so here is the finished pile of everything that I am going to be getting rid of. This is all going to be um, donated. That's how I'm going to pass it on to somebody else. So yeah, I think I did a pretty good job. There's quite a bit here. Uh, I did grab a few things from the other drawers that I had. So yeah, I'm actually really proud of this clear out. Okay guys, so that's going to be it for this video. I really hope you enjoyed it. Be sure to give it a big thumbs up if you did. Let me know in the comments which um new piece of clothing that i tried on was your favorite i don't know which favorite is mine like uh, i probably one of the pairs of jeans i would definitely say is my favorite from that also if you're not already subscribed it would be amazing if you did that would make me really happy and yeah i think that's gonna be all and i'll see you guys next time bye ow cat i didn't even step on you